Woo, good morning world. I just woke up in my van feeling blazing. And these boys had no idea where I was, but they got right to work, grabbing all my stuff, getting out of the van. Look at the mess. So, this morning's package is get everything from there into my new home. Permanently. Unfortunately, it is my last day with these boys and this beast. <laughs> yeah. I gotta get all this into here with style and class, finesse. And <laughs> <laughs> it would it plow would through that good. creek so easy, dude. Up that hill, through the cow fields. Oh my god. How do you feel, bro? Awesome. <laughs> Fucking good. Oh my god. I'm all showered up. Time to knock some laundry out. I gotta say, I'm pretty impressed for two weeks on the road. That's all my dirty laundry. <laughs> She wrote for your boy. You guys are about to crush it. Yeah, boys. Just like that, the boys are out. Make sure to follow these dudes as they continue to travel in the beast. Cannot be more grateful. Likewise, full circle, just being able to help them out and them helping me out is, that was just the trip of a lifetime. Back to home girl and my normal life. She is 90% packed. Just got some more dishes to load and clean clothes. And then we're out of here. My brother actually donated this bench to the SoCal house. So I'm gonna be throwing that in as well. And no joke, just got this in the mail here today. I believe my brother just gave it to me giant box from the boy Donovan Hedinger. We're going to open this up right now. What? Dude. What? Yo. Your boy is an absolute legend. <gasps> Dude. Donovan Hedinger. You are the absolute man, bro. I cannot even. 
come to words right now with how grateful I am that you just sent me this in the mail, dude. You couldn't be more talented. What? Woo! I'm like, without words, bro. You are such a G, dude. I cannot thank you enough. I actually have this wetsuit that I'm supposed to be shipping you along with all of this stuff in the front seat here that I owe a bunch of you guys. So I've been in the van and I didn't want to make these dudes drive around to all these places and try to ship stuff on the road. So I have it all in one bag. Just got back here. I'm going to get all that packaged up tonight and then tomorrow's Friday. So that will be shipped out to you. <sighs> Stoking so hard right now, man. I'm throwing this somewhere in the van. Super sick. I already got the homie Derek with the C vlogs log hookup. So Damn, dude, the fan love is unbelievable. The friends out there and the family through the vlog. I can't, I can't even, dude. You guys are amazing. Boom. That is everything. Fully packed up right now. About to uh, relax because I'm running off of like I think three hours or four hours of sleep or two. I don't even know, but might just head down to SoCal right now. Feeling pretty good. Oh, this is <laughs> I've always wanted to come up here. Jump off. No, I think I would, yeah. You would? Or you would rather? I would rather. <laughs> I think maybe if I was 16, I would probably do it. Go for the front roll. <laughs> We're trying to sell this whip. I should probably clean that thing. Well, yeah, and uh, Got another surprise for you guys <laughs> that I'm gonna wait to open. <laughs> I think it's time we take the little girl for a test run. bunch of stuff done one last stop to get gas and then I got energy man I think we're heading south Woo. one of my favorite features about this van is the size of the gas tank very large gas tank one of the largest holds so much gas great gas tank nobody holds gas better than this tank California, great gas prices. One of the greatest areas to buy gas. It is quite the emotional experience when you put $100 in a gas tank and you leave there without a full tank. Quite the feeling. Gotta love it, California. What do you guys think? Am I gonna make it south on this $100 bill, 27 gallons, one tank to Huntington Beach, seven hours away? I, I won't. I'm going to need more gas. I need a partner. Have you guys ever seen this before? Concentrated windshield washer fluid? I guess I got to use this hose to get this gallon mixture right. Such a weird situation. Want to hit me with a little more juice? You got it. Whoa. Sweet. Thank you so much. No problem. We are, uh, 99%. I think I'm gonna go say peace out to my brother. Make this happen. Uh, 
All right, and there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The van is nuclear packed. Coffee is made. I almost forgot the most essential weapon in my arsenal in my brother's basement. So that is the last item. And it is 9.15 right now. We're nuking it down south to Huntington Beach. I believe it is about six or seven hours, depending on your throttle body. But uh, here we go. Couldn't really be more stoked right now. Oh my God, nine o'clock on the dot. Post Malone new album just dropped. This is about to be the illest ride. <laughs> Saving pennies over here, filling up waters. Do it. All right, quick update. It is one in the morning. We are two hours away from Huntington Beach. It's freezing cold outside. Up loads of energy, and yeah, stoke is all time. Not out of gas, but. If you guys are driving down the five, huge tip. There's basically only one exit with regularly priced gas, and that exit is 257 on the five, heading north or south from SoCal to NorCal. So do not forget that if you're gonna get gas somewhere. 257 for the win. Woo! Thanks something. Just be thankful. Alright, next stop, Huntington Beach. Um, real quick, what the hell are these? Are you joking me? Dude! Is that real? Bro. Full blown plaza. The setup to the dumpster? Where is Jake Kirby when you need him? That is duly noted. We will be back. Woo. All right, so your boy made it. It is 3.30 right now. I don't really know what I'm going to do. I'm not going to bed, that's for sure. I guess I got to knock this edit out. I guess you will see how long it takes for me to upload all this footage, make the edit, and get it online, thumbnail, right up description whenever you see this video posted, whoever is the first one. Um, if you guys have any questions about like Huntington and SoCal and Newport Beach and how we ended up here and how I ended up having this be like my second home, feel free to ask. But uh, I'm gonna wrap this vlog up today. It's been long enough. And uh, tomorrow I will explain how we made it to Huntington Beach and where it all started. But that's it for now. Your boy has got some work to do and I'm probably gonna go surf in the next like two and a half hours here. Thanks for watching and we'll see you tomorrow. See vlogs, your boy's out.